really quickly before um this vlog starts i just realized i recorded a clip actually hear like a little click 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 noise so sorry in advance for that hopefully with the headphones in that doesn't happen and if not i'll just change the setting but yeah enjoy <laughs> what's up guys welcome back to my channel so today yet again of course a random vlog because that's how my vlogs are we don't plan them we just vlog when we feel like it but um i'm honestly I'm be real with you guys i've been really really sad lately like i was crying this morning um it's like my anxiety is literally out of control and i really don't know what to do at this point it's like it's sad it's becoming really sad and i'm home alone right now and my brother and his wife went out of town for a few days and the dog is not here and i'm literally just <laughs> i live in a really big house and i'm here by myself and i'm just like going through it so i'm about to stop this and get the fuck up and do something to make myself feel better because i don't like not being in control and i don't like that my anxiety can get me here i really don't i like being in control and I don't like how emotional I am because I don't like feeling like a little bitch I really don't so I'm about to get my ass up and I'm going to slightly beat my face I don't know I'm gonna try to make myself look better so that I feel better and then I'm going to put on something that makes me feel good and I'm going to go to the hair salon and I'm going to get my hair straightened and I might even cut some bangs today like we're just going to go for it like we're just going to do things to make ourselves feel better because there's just no reason that I should not be in control and like I just don't want to feel like this so I'm going to get up and I'm going to make myself feel better and look better and I'm going to eat stuff that tastes good and that fills me up and I'm not going to feel lonely or sad or anything. I'm just going to have a great day. So, I'm sorry for rambling, but let's go. Let's have a good day, guys. Okay, so I'm back. Um, I just put um, powder on my face. I'm not wearing any foundation today. I, I don't have it in me. But the only reason I did my eye makeup, to be 100% honest with everyone, is so that I won't cry. I feel like if my eye makeup is done, maybe I will keep my shit together and not cry and mess it up because I know I can't rub my eyes or anything. So, yeah, I'm about to go get my hair done. I really need to re-dye it first, but honestly, I'll just re-dye it later. Like, it might look pretty cool straightened, looking ashy blue. Like, it looks like a denim type blue right now. So, maybe that'll look cool straightened. Um... When I was getting ready to go, when I started doing my makeup, I started bawling out of nowhere. Like, I didn't expect my anxiety to be this real, but the past two weeks has been kicking my ass. It's pretty bad, I can't lie. But um, I was going to put that clip in here, but I'm deciding not to because it was just a lot. And maybe I'll make it a separate video because this is very important, like mental health is not a joke anyone that thinks it is a joke this is not a joke it's not a game and it really sucks when something's wrong with you and people can't see it physically so they think oh you're fine you're just making that shit up like this is not a fucking game but yeah i'm about to go to the salon now actually i'm about to grab something to eat and then go because i don't want to be in the salon for hours starving and that'll just make me sadder than I already am. And that is not the goal of today. Today is the goal is to be happy and enjoy the weather. So let's let's get happy. Let's enjoy this weather. Okay, okay. I need to put some pants on because I'm pantless right now. And get my shit together. But I think I'm ready to go now. So let's go to the salon, guys. Okay, so I'm about to go get my hair done. And turn the alarm on. At first, I thought it was so stupid that we had an alarm system, but 
now that I'm home by myself, I'm like, yay, we have an alarm system. I don't know, it makes me feel a little more secure. But yeah, it's time to go get this freaking hair did. It's freaking beautiful outside. And I've been up since 9 a.m. I'm pretty sure it's almost like 4 now. And I haven't eaten anything all day. I don't know. I've just been in my fucking feelings. I don't know why I've been so sad and anxious and depressed and... What the fuck? I have no gas. That's cool too. But yeah, I'm about to go to... I'm gonna go to Checkers. I'm gonna just get some french fries and a Sprite or something because I haven't had soda in a minute. And I'm gonna go to the hair salon. They're both literally right up the street, so... Hopefully there's no wait. It's Wednesday, so there should be no wait, hopefully. But yeah, I'm about to go do that, and then I'll see you at the salon. Bye. So I just pulled up, and there's literally no parking there, but I found this parking lot here, and I hope it's okay that I'm here, but I should be in and out, so it should be okay. But I don't know if it's because I haven't had soda in a minute, or if this Sprite is just amazing, but this Sprite is amazing. I feel a little better. Being in the sun definitely helps. I always notice being outside always makes me feel better. I love nature. This is definitely helping. I just hope that this lady does not give me heat damage because I just grew it out. So, I have faith though, I have faith. So I'm leaving the hair salon. She did a pretty good job on my hair. Um, I don't know why every time you go to the hair salon, they bump the ends of your hair. Like this is like the 1970s, but whatever. But I mean, as you can see, it has bounced. So I'm cool with that. After I wrap my hair, I know it'll all be good. So I'm not really that pressed. I low key want to cut bangs but I can't decide if they look good or not. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I think my hair looks really cool right now with like all the faded colors and I'm glad that I did this now because I'm probably not gonna straighten my hair again for a while. I see that I do have like a few dead ends, very minimal, so I'm happy that she didn't like fry my hair off, but I'm definitely gonna trim my hair, but this is cool because I haven't trimmed my hair in like four months, so. It's probably time anyway. So yeah, Let's show you my hair. Hopefully you guys could uh, see that good. So yeah, I'm digging it right now. I'm definitely going to wrap my hair when I get inside and get something to eat. Cause all I ate was those french fries from Checkers. And I got this ginormous drink from Checkers. I have like a drop left, but. very happy that I had some Sprite today, but then I'm going to go be inside and be a little healthy child and drink fucking water, okay? And yeah, I'll check back in with you guys. Also, I just wanted to say I'm feeling a lot better. I was outside in the sun. I got my hair done. I put some makeup on so it made me feel better. I got something to eat. Um, I was, I think I was around people, so that kind of helped and i was watching videos on my ipad um to like pass the time and i don't know it was really nice just chilling and just not thinking about all of the stuff i was thinking about this morning like just getting out the house and forcing yourself to get out really helps because it took a lot for me to get out the house i woke up at 9 a.m i didn't get out the house until 3 45 it's 6 46. All I did was get my hair done and get something to drink. It's like, and my day is pretty much over now. Like, now I'm about to eat and go inside and do whatever to do inside. But, yeah, I just want to let you guys know, I am feeling much better. It's just, you got to force yourself out of that funk. 
and I know it's hard. I know. I literally broke down today. I know. So if I could have that type of morning and I'm okay right now, I mean, I'm not beaming off the walls. I'm not about to fucking, I don't know, do anything crazy, but like, I'm chilling right now. I feel good. I can touch my scalp, which if you have natural hair, you know how amazing it is when you straighten your hair every once in a blue and you can touch your scalp. And it's like, wow, who knew what that felt like? <laughs> but yeah, like, I'm chilling. See, I'm making jokes. I'm all right. So yeah, I'll, I'll be back. I'm babbling. I'll be back. Okay, so I just um, walked inside my room and it's better lighting. See, it's super faded. Um, my hair was red previously, and I only took out, like, half of the red before I put the blue over it, because I got lazy. But, yeah, that's why you can see, like, it's a little bit of red or, like, purple, because, like, the blue's fading on top of it. Whatever, you guys know your colors. Yeah. But I was about to wrap my hair, and I just noticed my scalp is so sensitive. Like, I haven't been to a hair salon in, like, three years, and that round brush and that blow dryer on my scalp ow like ow but yeah i'm about to wrap my hair and put a little bit of oil in it i, I normally don't put oil on it when i first straighten my hair just because i want it to have bounce for a little bit but i feel like i need to put a little bit of oil in it like she went to town but one thing i can say is i did notice she put a good amount of heat protectant in my hair so she's trying i'm not that mad plus my hair was pretty moisturized before I went and it was de um, already detangled so it's not like she was really pulling my hair out at all so I don't know I feel pretty good with this I don't feel like I'm gonna have any heat damage but you know fingers crossed so I just took off the eye makeup and moisturized my face it is 12:37 a.m. I've been home since uh, six something. I don't remember when I last checked in and I said I was going to eat and do stuff and like be good for the rest of the day. I definitely, um, I do not feel as bad as I was this morning. This morning was horrible, but I'm definitely not, I'm still not there yet. I'm forcing happiness into myself and I've never had to do this before like my anxiety has never been this real to where I know that I have to do something about it before it just gets out of control because it's been it's just getting worse and worse and worse and it's only been over like the past two possibly three weeks now that it's just been snowballing into this giant thing and I don't want it to become anything bigger than what it already is so I just wanted to be real with you guys, let you guys know, like, I'm not happy, but I'm trying, I really am, and I didn't eat anything at all today besides some french fries, and I've been up since 9 a.m., it's 12.30 the next day, I need to feed myself, so I'm going to force myself to eat something right now, which feels horrible to even think that I have to force myself to eat, but I literally have no appetite, like, I know I'm hungry, but I have a taste for nothing, and I'm, I don't want to eat anything. I literally, I just have no urge to eat at all, like, but I'm not trying to die, and I'm not trying to lose weight out here, so, literally forcing myself to take care of myself, and it's such a task, like, you think this would just be, like, regular stuff, like, no, this is not easy, today was not easy right now is not easy but I'm gonna be okay so I'm very I don't want to say I'm sorry but I am sorry if this vlog was a little depressing but also I'm just trying to be real with you guys I'm a real ass person and I have feelings and I have anxiety so it is what it is but thank you for watching please I don't know, leave a nice comment, that's really all I want, I, I could care less if you like this video, like, I don't care, but comments are cool, so, yeah, bye.